warm. I am starting a startup. I know we're acting stupid. So if you haven't been living under a rock for the past couple of years, you've been hearing all this fuss about all these startups, valued at a million dollars, a billion dollars, unicorns here and there. You know what? I want in. And that is why I have decided to start a startup. Okay, that's not really what I'm doing. I just like the way it sounds. Start a startup, kind of, you know, play with words. But here's the deal. I'm someone who likes to have side projects all the time. I have a full-time job, sure, but what am I doing between 6 and 11 or whatever I do when I go to, go to bed? What am I doing? I need something to do. If I don't have anything to do, I get anxious, restless, bored, irritated, all that stuff. So, I've had this idea for quite a while for a, a product, service, business, and I've been thinking about it for probably half a year. And I remember someone saying that if you have an idea, and you think about it and you still think it's good six months later, that's probably a good idea. And you know what? We're there right now, so it's time to start doing this. A couple of months ago, I learned how to code and I built my first app. Throwback to that. No. Pretty Caroline, oh, 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 stone cold stunner. She was a winner, started working at the dine. Oh, 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 serves this up her mind. To count your blessings, cause it's telling for And it was quite a fun experience and I really liked that process of, you know, taking something, taking an idea and building something out of it. It was quite fun. So I'm looking to do something similar with this project, but I'm just going to make it a bit more complex. And if you compare it to the one I just showed you a throwback to, or the app I built called Sauced for cocktails, this is probably going to be a much larger time investment and cash investment. But hey, if it doesn't work out, I'll probably just not eat for a year. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. So what I will be doing is I'm going to be making an app slash service. So it's, there's two parts to it. There's a code part and that's just building the app itself. And then there's another part which is basically acquiring the stuff which is going to be in the app. I don't think anyone's going to steal this idea, but just in case, I'm not going to tell you exactly what it is at the beginning and I'm probably going to delay these videos uh, a little bit. And then when I was getting ready to start this, I went through my old hard drive and I found like two terabytes of just videos from between when I was like 12 and 18. And I just I just remember seeing these videos, I'd record all summer, make a summer compilation, I'd go down to the football pitch by myself every weekend and just take shots on goal, record it. And I really enjoyed that process of, you know, documenting it. And it was a lot of fun now when I found it 10 years later of me just, you know, kicking the ball at an empty goal with music in the background. It was a lot of fun. So that's what I'm looking to do with this one as well. Hopefully in, you know, five years, 10 years, 20 years, even 40 years, I'll be able to look back at this and say, damn, look at that, that's when I succeeded with this, this project. Or I'm open to the possibility that it fails. Look, look back at that one. Okay, look, that's how it was when I failed on this, my first big starting a startup project, but not really. Um, what I plan on doing is I'm gonna document most of the process. And like I said, I'll probably delay how the videos come out. So, you know, I'll make a bit of the business app first and then I'll put out the videos later if I even put this out I don't know yet if, or if I just want to document it for myself in the future which could be fun too um, but I'm planning to do it in episodes where you know we have this is episode one obviously and then you know just the whole process itself uh, from step one to a hundred probably maybe it ends at ten maybe it never ends you know you never know but just something like that and then see where it goes as we go I think it also could be interesting because if you look on YouTube, for example, there's not, there's not a lot of content out there of people, you know, starting things from scratch and then just going with it and you showing you the whole process. And that's what I plan on doing. I'm going to try to be quite open with, you know, and I'm going to be open with it just so that everyone can see and so that I can see in the future, you know, what this was really like. And hopefully I can learn some more from this than if I was just to do it in isolation, you know. So if this sounds interesting, then please follow along the journey. I'm going to try to put out videos as frequently as I can. Probably in the beginning it's not going to be too much fun because it's just going to be a lot of coding building this uh, app. But hopefully as it picks up, you know, there's going to be a bit more content maybe once a week, maybe once every two weeks. There's going to be quite a lot of stuff happening. I hope, I really hope, because I've been thinking about this business idea for like eight months. New Year's 2021, I started thinking about it and now it's August 2021. 
So it's been quite some time and I still feel like I really want to do this. So that's probably a sign that it's worth worth doing. But, you know, I may change my mind two weeks in, we'll see. And then this video could be, just be fun the way it is by itself. So if you're interested, please stay tuned, you know, subscribe, that whole ordeal. And, and just follow along and we'll see what happens. Thank you. Have a good life. I know you're acting stupid. Maybe just a little.